Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Essence of Shay. Let's get started. Last week I talked about the three things that I love about my locks. But it was I also sat down and thought about the th the couple of things that I regret about having locks. Not hate, but that would be another video. But I regret about my lock journey and what took place. So I have about three things. So I'm gonna keep it to three. I did three last week, I'll do three this week. So I have three things that I kind of regret about my lock journey that I wish I could change, but I can't. Um, and let's get started. If you haven't already, please click that subscribe button. Um, we are getting larger by the, the minute and I just want to continue to grow. And also, um, like this video. I know you don't know what's going on in this video yet, but I never disappoint you guys. So just like the video and let's get started. Okay, my regret number one is styling my hair so much in the beginning. You know, like when you first start your locks, you want your locks to be neat, you want them to look good. And I styled my, I wanna say I washed and styled my hair like every two weeks when I first started my locks. And this was not good in because it damaged, it, it was, it was very damaging. I got a lot of split ends. I got a lot of breakage, breakage on my roots. It caused my locks to get thinner than what they originally started off with. So I regret styling it so much. Like I don't regret having my styles because I love my styles, but doing them so frequently didn't help my locks at all. My regret number two is coloring my hair so much. Let me tell y'all, I went through red, blonde, green, red again, blonde again. Like I colored my hair so much and I use bleach as well. And bleach in general with locks or without breaks is very harmful for the hair. And especially with locks, I always colored my hair. And in the beginning, I didn't know what I was doing. So I'm pretty sure I left some color in my locks, which damages my locks on top of it. But the excessive harsh chemicals that I kept putting in my hair kind of changed um, the structure of my hair and how soft it was. Like it's getting back to the healthiness that it used to be in the beginning, but it took me a lot of years to get it back to how I wanted it to because the coloring, the the, the styling, the washing it every minute, that plays a major role in how your locks is. It breaks it, it damages it. You get a lot of build, like there's not build up, but your lock, your lock texture will not be the same after just one um, session with bleaching. So imagine doing, I only bleach my hair once, but I've used harsh um, coloring boxes to color my hair without properly treating it before and after. So that caused major, major problem with, problems with my locks, but I'm, I got it back to kind of how it started off in the beginning so I'm super happy about that but side note if you don't know how to color your hair don't color it on your own it may seem easy we may come up on YouTube and make it seem like there's a walk in the park but if not done properly it could really strip the oils and damage your hair very bad so my last and final regret you guys if you've been following me for a while if you haven't and you just started by the way welcome to my channel um but i spoke about shaving my locks now i tell this story all the time so i'm not gonna go too much into details about this if you haven't i have a few video if you want to know about the story i have a few videos in which i talk about it but long story short um when I first started my locks, my locks were super thick, like tree trunk type thick. And um, I, didn't, I, w I didn't educate myself about it. I just knew I wanted locks, I started them. And when I moved back to New York, a lady down the block um, from my, my family home, she said that she did locks. So I trusted what she had to do and she shaved um, my locks, like shaved them with a razor, like a, 
a razor that they use on men's facial hair she shaved my locks to make them thinner than what they were because she said that was the only way that my locks would get fit like not as thick which i didn't know was true i mean when i think about it right now is like common sense like huh? huh you really fell for that bro but i did i did i was young stupid i did i did and um now i can educate myself and say that well styling and um twisting over time your lock can get thinner it doesn't need to go that long route into shaving it and unfortunately that would that's what happened to me so if i ever wanted to i'm pretty sure now i'll be fine 14 years in i'm pretty sure it'd be fine but if i ever wanted to like comb out my hair it wouldn't be that much i felt like it wouldn't be that much left because of shaving it you're breaking the 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 your hair strands you're breaking them so they're not the same anymore they're kind of in pieces it's like a scissors that you you break you guys get what i'm saying like you break it down it's not the same anymore so but now i'm pretty sure all that has grown out and yeah, I'm pretty sure all that is going out. But those are my three uh, regrets in my lock journey so far. Um, I'm pretty sure I have a whole bunch more, but those are my top three regrets. What are your top three regrets? Leave comments below. You guys did so well on the last video about what your regrets were. I mean, what you loved about your hair, and I loved it. I loved, I loved it, but let's be realistic. We do regret some things about our log journey that unfortunately we can't change because it already happened so leave comments below let me know what your three regrets are on your log journey so far if you haven't already please click that like button let's try to get this to a hundred likes and if you haven't already subscribe click the subscribe button i mean while we at it i'll just sit and wait so you could, you know, it doesn't take that long. Just that little red button, click it. I'll wait. <sighs> Did you do it? Okay, cool. So anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video. I'll see you later, Tiger Lilies. Toodles.